What well, lads, what's the crack? My name is Orgy Runner and welcome to The Legend of Zelda Twilight Princess on the GameCube. Yikes, it has been ages and ages and ages since I played this game. In fact, I'll be honest, I've never really played any other Legend of Zelda game bar this one because going back to the year 2006, that's when it came out, I really wanted to buy a Nintendo Wii just to use the motion controls for it because the ads for it were amazing. Just to be able to swing your little Wii remote around and pretend you had a little sword like Link just seemed very awesome at, at, at the time and it was still kind of a gimmick but still it was one of the many games that wanted me to buy a Wii. Of course I never really got a Wii, I never bought a Wii until they stopped production and I only bought a Wii because I just wanted to soft mod it and play whatever GameCube games I had at the time. By the way, this is technically a pirate copy. I'll be honest, but don't sue me, Nintendo. Don't sue me. 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 I have a physical copy right here. It's legit. I bought this myself in in 2006. It's a legit copy. Look. There you go. See that? So shit. I own a physical copy. Can't be Farsi, even though technically, maybe it is. But people might be saying, well, Runner, why can't you just uh, play it in the optical disk drive? Boy, I took out the optical disk drive, or I never reinstalled it into my new PC case, because optical-based media on PC is dead. It's dead in the water. Nobody buys physical copies of PC games now. In fact, I don't think there are any physical copies of PC games you can buy these days unless, of course, they're pre-owned. The last game I thought was a physical copy that I bought was Tekken 7. And hold on, bear with me one moment. I ordered this from GameStop uh, about maybe two or three years ago. It was on sale. I bought it for something like a tenner and it was a good deal. And when I opened it... This is what I got. A Steam code. I wasn't even aware these things existed back then. I thought it was going to be a disc and I'd have to install my disc drive again. But no, it's a Steam code. Yep. So I'm not installing my disc drive because one, it's up in the attic. Two, it's too much hassle. Three, my PC case is a state. There's a lot of dust build up. Oh God. PC gods, don't fucking slay me. But, yeah, I'm not arsed to install my disk drive just for the sake of playing this when I can download a copy of it. So, I legally own it. It's legit, but I've heard Nintendo are pretty strict about their IPs being used on YouTube, so I don't know what way this is going to go. Whether or not Nintendo will strike me down or will threaten legal action of some kind. But, eh, I don't know. I did a bit, bit of research on this as well. It's a pretty popular game to play, so, or so I've heard. Also, I've wanted to bring Nintendo gameplay content or Nintendo content to my channel for a long while. So I thought, why not The Legend of Zelda? Why not play a game that I haven't played in over... 15, 16 years? 16 years! This game is 16 years old. That is over a decade old. It makes it sound a lot older than it actually is, but it is a very old game. I know there's a HD remaster for the Wii U. Of course, I didn't buy a Wii U, nor do I intend on buying one. And I think there's also a HD remaster on the Switch, although I could be wrong. I don't see myself buying a Switch. Uh, point being, this is probably the only Zelda game I've played. It is the only Zelda game I've played. Uh, yeah, so we'll just get right into it. I'll see if it's as good as I remember. Uh, bang up job on the intro runner. Uh, yeah. I'll just leave everything as is. I'll leave his name as Link. I could call him runner, but, uh, uh th that sounds uh, pretty bland. Just like your commentary. Good observation there, viewer. Good observation. And I'll leave the horse's name as Epona. The good old pieball. Damn, that would have been a good name to call him, or her. Uh, brightness check symbol. The screen is too dark to see. Clearly, just the brightness, four colors. I, 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 I don't know how to do that. It's, it's not letting me adjust the, the colors or anything. It, 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 it 
it's fine. It's, it's good. It looks all right. I can see it. You can see it. We're all good. And yes, I am running this on the Dolphin emulator. And boy, God, does it make the game look sharp. Because I have this upscaled to 4K, but of course, like always, I upload my content in 1080p, but this is going to be in 30 FPS. There are hacks you can use or mods that allow you to play it in 60 FPS, but it's not really true 60 FPS. It's just basically speeding up the game. Anywho, there's dialogue here. Tell me. Do you ever feel a strange sadness as dusk falls? Yes, I'm feeling a strange sadness right now knowing that I have work tomorrow. They say it's the only time when our world intersects with theirs. The only time we can feel the lingering regrets of spirits who have left our world. Good God, you have a big nose. That is why loneliness always prevails the hour of twilight or... That is why loneliness always pervades the hour of twilight. Ah, uh, <laughs> see? Twilight, Twilight Princess, I see where this is going. But enough talk of sadness. I have a favour to ask of you, Link. I was supposed to deliver something to the royal family of Hyrule the day after tomorrow. Yes, it was a task set to me by the mayor, but would you go in my stead? Why, why can't you do it? What's wrong with you? You have. Never been to Hyrule, right? In the kingdom of Hyrule, there is a great castle, and around it is a castle town. A community far bigger than our little village. And far bigger than Hyrule is the rest of the world the gods created. You should look upon it all with your own eyes. It's getting late. We should head back to the village. I will talk to the mayor about this matter. And there's our little mute friend Link. He's got such a cute face. And there's our little horse, Ipona. You know what? I'm half thinking about cutting all the sort of cutscenes or skipping past some of them. But then again, it would be a true let's play and and revisit of this game for me unless I went through all of them. Because it's um, a trip down memory lane. Like I said at the start of the video, I have not touched this game since I passed it back in 2006. Or was it 2007 that I passed it? But it doesn't matter. I played it, I passed it, I enjoyed the hell out of it. God, speaking of which, I never really used my GameCube much after that. I, ha I bought a few games for it. And I think I bought one or two cents, but I have not been asked to plug it into my TV. Or even get a HDMI adapter for it. Oh, there's little Jimmy and, and the wife Sophia. I'm just kidding, I have no idea of their names. Ooh, is that our house? I do believe that is our house. Oh, who's this youngin? Hey, she's still on my horse! Where are you going with my horse, dammit? Hey! <laughs> oh, the non-existent dialogue. Hey! I forgot... These people don't communicate in the uh, English tongue, only in grunts and hey and whatever. Hey Link, you there? Hey, you mind helping me herd the goats? What do I look like, a farmer? Well, I suppose I do have the duds for it. They ain't listen to me lately. Oh, what? Do you think they're going to listen to little old me? What am I, the ghost whisperer? The goat whisperer, sorry. Did I say ghosts? I accidentally probably did. Even though I didn't agree to anything because I'm a mute. Evidently. Link has not spoken one word in his entire life over the lifespan of God knows how many sequels and prequels. Hey, where's the opponent? 
She was stolen. Did you not see her take it? Or take t take my horse? Yeah, I'm gonna speak to you, buddy. Hey. <laughs> Come on now, hurry up and bring Epona with you. I would, but some random bure took her. It's down this way, wasn't it? Ooh, squirrel. Are you gonna lead me to my horse? Come on, lead me to my piebald pony. Okay, now never mind, you're useless. Oh. Okay, and we have no items. Wait, what the hell was that? Oh, that's the first person view. Ah, uh, and look at all these ch textures. Mm, mm, mm. You gotta love that crisp 480p. Although, like you said, this will be uploaded in 1080 because it is upscaled. That is the greatest thing about emulators. It makes games look as crisp as they can be on modern screens. Oh Jesus! Look at the mushrooms on this guy. Not a bother to him. You got any more rupees? I do remember the currency, and yes, they are rupees. Ow! 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 Oh no! That that kind of hurt. Okay. Any more under here? Who the hell is burying money under rocks? What sort of psycho are we dealing with here? I don't know, but either way, once I find that girl who stole my horse, she's gonna get it. Ah, there's my horse. Hey, you! Come here! There's a bit of a weird outline to her, but I'm guessing that's something to do with the emulator. Oh, hi Link. Hey, don't hi Link me. What the hell are you doing with my horse? You fucking piebald thief. I washed the opponent for you. Yeah, I didn't ask you to. Guy's got a hell of a rape face on him. Give me that horse. Oh! We can flip her. Cool! Mush, pony, mush! Come on! Come on, the pie ball! So where are these goats? Uh oh. Did I do bad? Oh no, this is our lovely fair village of Orden Village. And your man's going crazy there with his sword. What are you trying to do? Preparing for some sort of invasion? Although I do think that actually does happen. So where's your man and these freaking goats? He's nowhere to be seen. Guessing this way? Wait, was you I was talking to before? Pretty sure what? No, oh, no, no, no. You're a mirror, I think. Are you? And what's the, what's with the weird ass beard? Or are are those tusks? Oh, Link. Looks like you're going to help Fado. Good job. He headed up the ranch ahead of you. Go on. Climb up on the pony and get going. If you don't hurry, the sun will go down. Okay, yeah, that normally that's 
that's normally what happens at dusk. And again, I assume we don't have lanterns or flashlights or anything like that. Are those the goats? Orden Ranch. Okay, I'm assuming those are the goats, even though they have weird ass horns on them. Sorry to get you over here in such a hurry, Link. These guys have been awful skittish lately. They won't listen to a word I say. Probably because they don't speak whatever the hell you speak. Sorry to ask, bud, but how's about you and Epona herd him into the barn real quick? We ain't got much time, so you think you can do it for me? Nah, bro. I'm betting that with you two helping out, it'll be done in no time. Just say the word once you all are ready to get started. Okay, you know, I'll, I'll do it. Much obliged, dear bud. Okay, then. Go and herd all them little scamps into the barn for me. Okay. Yeah, come on. Mush. Get in there, you little bitch. Go on. There's one out of ten. One. One. Whoa, 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 one. Whoa, whoa, go on. Into the barn. One. Get in there, you bastards. One. Join your brothers and sisters. Go on. In there, mush. Wait, whoa, 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 oh, ow. Okay, no shit or skittish. Alright, you little son of a bitch. Come on. Get your hairy behind in there. Come on. Okay, four down, only six to go. Come on. Hun. Come on, hun. Get your hairy behinds in there. Go on. Okay, two more, two more. That's all we have. Come on. Yeah, come on! Man to fuck, man to fuck. Get the fuck in the barn. In there, Bessie. Go on, Bessie. Mush! There you go. And as for you, you're the one who poked me off. Hunt! Get in there, you little bastard. Go on! Shoo! Sh get! <gasps> oh, ow, ow, ow. Oh, you're gonna get it. Get in there, you hairy gull! What? Un. Not that way! Why can't you be like the other goats? Go on! Do I look like I've all day to be mushing you around the place? Go on! Shkit! Un. That's the way, that's the way. One, shoot! Now, am I going to get paid for this or not? Link, Epona, much obliged to both of y'all. I can cover anything tomorrow without having to trouble you. So, just sit back and relax, but okay, I will do that, except I have a job to do tomorrow. Oh, but uh, how about today? Want to practice with defenses? What do you mean, I do I want to practice with defenses? Just wait a spell, bud. I'll get them fences set up. Practice what exactly? Oh, sorry that took so long. Okay then, you all ride all you want. You all get tired of riding, just jump the gate and head back into the village, okay, bud? Yeah, okay. Oh, okay, so she can jump over fences and shiz. Whoosh! There we go. Now I'm getting the hang of this. Woo! Do I want to save? Yes, I do indeed. Oh, I love those classic Nintendo sounds. Oh. 
I've really wanted to play the older uh, Legend of Zelda games as well. You know, Ocarina of Time and Majora's Mask. I've actually wanted to buy the physical cartridges as well, but they're just so damn expensive. Well, especially Ocarina of Time if it's the gold cartridge. And I do have a Nintendo 64 stuffed up in my attic, so... Yeah, I, I might catch a spell of three days of work or something, or I might have a few days off. I can actually spend some time playing those games myself. To save your progress during your game, press start and then choose the save option. Oh, thank God I can save the game at any point. Oh, I thought there was going to be like little save points or save spaces or something like that where I had to go to to save the game. But no, I can save anywhere. Love it. What the hell are you three gremlins looking at? Hey. I'm beginning to think hey is the only spoken word in their vocabulary. The rest is just telepathic. Hey, wake up, Link. It's morning already. That's what I imagine they sound like. Oh, look at those sun rays. Is that ray tracing in a GameCube game? Oh, wait, I can look out again, can I? Oh, I can. And the three gremlins are still out there waiting for me. Yeah, well, let's go talk to them and see what they want. Ah, and this is the inside of my studio apartment. Not too bad for living inside a tree. I mean, did you haul this up yourself? And I see you've also got yourself a trident. What, did you slay the king of Atlantis? You devil. So, there's no items in here I can pick up or anything like that. No, and I'm assuming this is the way out of the house, right? Of course, it is. It's a door. Why wouldn't it be? But I'm anxious to see what's down here. Is it like a secret way out? Huh? Um. What the hell is that? I. S I see two eyes going into darkness and they don't look friendly, so I'm gonna head back. If I can. Uh, I sure hope that's not a monster. There right, we go. <laughs> nice. Hey, you, shrimp, stay away from my horse. Ha, hi, Link. You have the day off work today, right? So, I finished the fishing rod I was making. Link, I figured I'd give it to you first thing in the morning, but my dad said you just wait until Link comes to get it, so I didn't bring it to you. Well, screw your dad. I don't give a shit what he says. I want that fishing rod now. Where's your house? And also, what do you three gremlins want? Ah. Oh, Link, did you hear? They're selling a slingshot at the store right now. A slingshot! I wonder how powerful it is. I I need... I, I must try it. Tallow, if you and Mallow want it so badly, just buy it at my pair shop. Yeah. Do you see any rupees in my hand? I can't afford that thing. Come on, Beth. Can't you just loan it to us for a while? You don't want to get in trouble for that. If you two want it, save up your allowances or something. But our allowances are terrible. Aww. I wish I was born into a family with a slingshot instead of one with a water wheel. 
Having a water wheel outside your house sounds absolutely freaking cool. You spoiled little shit. You have the day off from work, don't you? <sighs> Didn't I go through this dialogue with you already? You have to give a pony a day off too. Poor girl. Ah, fine. Using my stupid feet to travel down. Oh no, that's the lake, I think. Okay, don't know why I went in there. So far, it's a pretty slow start, I'll, I will admit. Probably won't get into any action for... Well, I won't say quite a long time, but... It's just a very slow build-up, that's all. So where is this kid's house? Hey. Yo, Link. Yo, who up here? I want to talk to you. Press A while holding L to see you so we can chat. Wait, is that how you chat? Ah, okay. Oh. Hey, there you go. Over here. Yeah. Your voice carries well, as usual. Um, I don't think we're speaking. I think we're speaking uh, telepathically. Is the only words I have heard so far is, "Hey, hey, hey, listen." Maybe you can teach my tykes that you gotta press A while targeting to talk to people from a distance. They don't get it. Um, right, that's the first thing I've got to teach my child as well. No, we d No, Sonny Jim, we don't use the English vernacular. We use A. And L. That's how real men talk. Oh, shit, I missed that. So, listen. <coughs> oh, sorry. <coughs> Broke character. So, listen. Why don't you climb off those vines to their link? Alright, don't mind if I do. Well, uh, then never mind, I'm going for a swim instead, I guess. Oh, it's automatic. Cool. Yo, there you are. Check this out. You know Sarah at the general store? Well, isn't that her cat over there? He's just been sitting there next to my house having a steering contest with the creek. You don't suppose he's thinking he's going to catch a fish, do you? <laughs> a cat can't catch no fish. Anyway, that's not what I was meaning to tell you about. I want you to take a look at something. See that grass growing there on the edge of that rock? Haven't I seen you whistling with that stuff? I figured it was pretty rare to see it growing in a place like that, so I thought I'd let you... I bet you could hop across these rocks with just a quick little... Hop, couldn't you? Suppose I could. I'll get. I'll give it a try. Hey. Oh, I did it! Yay! Go me! Oh, we can go on it. Ooh, neat trick. Uh oh, what's happening? Oh, we called it a little eagle. That's cool. But where do I want, want to send you? Right over to that guy? Oh! <laughs> hey, get wrecked, son. Oh, uh oh, 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 oh. Okay. Cool, I guess. What am I trying to do? Well, don't tell me you have to send that eagle to kill the cat, do I? That'd be kind of rough. fish with the seagull here. I don't know. What do I have to do? Oh, okay. Well, clearly not that. 
Oh, oh, I get it now. I get it. I get it. I see fish. Okay, so there's some fishies here, so maybe that's what I have to do. Okay, clearly not. Call me crazy, but I could listen to that grass whistle all day long. So anyway, I guess I'll just get back to my lounging. Ah. So that was all for nothing, was it? Well, thanks for that, bud. What do I have to do now? Wait, where are you? Why you look so sad? Is it because you're fat? Oh, um, good morning to you. If you're looking for my husband, he took his sword and left early this morning. But I must ask, Link. You've not seen a cradle come floating by here, have you? It is a baby's cradle made of finely woven free bark. Oh, such misfortune. How far could it have drifted, I wonder? Oh, so you're not fat, you're pregnant, okay. So that is another problem for me to solve, is it? Well, too bad I ain't interested. I want to progress in this game. I want to get to the main story. I want to get to the guts of the game. That is the whole point of this Let's Play series, probably. I'm not sure if I'll make this a series. It all depends how this first episode turns out. Uh, and right now, I'm just running around like a headless chicken, trying to figure out who I have to talk to, why I have to talk to them. And where I have to talk to them. Morning, Link. Sounds like Pado's handling things at the ranch on his own today. When he's up there alone, I always figure some calamity or others is going to happen. What? 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 Oh, speak of the devil. Uh oh. You ain't going to get past me, boy. Ow. Ah, the town's precious livestock. That's why I'm uneasy about leaving the ranch in Fado's hands. If you plant your feet while grabbing it with A, you'll can that goat down real quick. If any more goats get loose, you'll be sure to grab them like that. So, is that what I have to do? Uh-oh. Let's try this again. Oh, no, 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 no. Yeah, take that, you little bitch. Oh, uh, Fado did it again. These goats have been awful skittish lately. You always gotta be on your toes. Sorry about that, Link, but thanks to you, that goat didn't get away. That Fado. Looks like I'll be garnishing the cost of that goat from his wages. Oh, kind of harsh. There you go, buddy. Oh, you can, you can pet them. That's cool. Can I give it a kick up the ass? No, I don't think so. Well, where's... Where's my guy with the sword? Where'd he go? Isn't he supposed to give me a fishing rod? Oh, money. Maybe he's in here. Puppy! Puppy dog, you're coming with me. Bye, lady. I'm taking your pup. Oh, never mind. You can't do that. Oh, well. Them's the brakes. Clearly, what I'm looking for is not in here. Well, hey, morning, Link. Got a day off from work today, my boy? Not me. The wife's been hassling me. Today's the day to restock our store. Look. See that? Up in that tree? You can get a better view by tilting the that, that and just by using here to look around. Just by the way, yeah, some ordinary bees built themselves a fine nest up there, and I was thinking about knocking it down. Our cat hasn't come home since yesterday, so the wife's in a bad mood. At the very least, I need to bring something home to her. 
And that's where the slingshot is going to come in handy. But I don't know where to get it. Ouch. Alright, I have no idea what I'm supposed to do now. So, one, I have to get the cradle back. Two, I have to knock down that beehive there. And then I assume once I knock that down, I get the... the, the what you call it? The slingshot. So what I have to do first is call that hawk and he'll probably knock down the hive. Is that right? Or I could entirely be wrong. Okay, so we'll try problem number one first. Knocking down this beehive. Ooh, okay, that's nice. Actually, that's kind of disgusting. I have no idea what those things are. There you are, hockey. Now, to get that cradle back, I think. Ah, you coward. Right, so what do I get from this hive here? Nothing. Great, fantastic. Calling down a hawk? Why didn't I think of that? I was trying to knock that down by myself, but you beat me too, my boy. So what now? Like, what is up here? Wait, can I not climb up? Up these vines here? Or can I at least go in the house now? Nope. Still locked. And I'm still clueless. Maybe I have to hop over to that monkey and grab the thing we jig off him. Oh, okay, here we go. Now we're getting places. Okay, line up to shut. Oh, it's so hard to do it. Bit. No, that's too much up, that's too much down. Perfect! Oh, get right! Nice one, Link. Now we're making progress slowly but surely. Jesus, it took me all of what 20 minutes to figure that out. Oh, Link, that cradle. Did you go to the trouble of finding it for me? My thanks to you. Oh, that reminds me. There is something I am supposed to give to you. Do you think you could carry that cradle and come with me back to my house? Sure thing, Sophia, or whatever the hell your name is. That's a take your time. Can I just run ahead of you and you just automatically show? Oh, I, I could have done that all along. My thanks to you, Link. Yes, yes. I'd nearly forgotten. I'm supposed to give you this. <laughs> all right, here you go. Oh my god, I got the fishing rod. Yee, boy. You can now catch fish without bait, but you'll catch a large variety of fish with bait. Okay. It is a little unpolished. My son, Colin, made this under the instruction of his father. 
You can use it if you like. Oh, thanks, and that will be that. That'll be an episode. Yikes. No, I didn't really get much done in this, but maybe if I do make a second part, depending how all this turns out, if Nintendo strike it or wh whatever the hell it is going to happen, I don't know. I know I'm not going to be sued. I know Nintendo aren't that bad, but they are very protective of their IPs. I don't know, it's something to do with Japanese culture or at least Nintendo culture. Because I've heard of a lot of people getting struck down from playing Pokemon and stuff like that. But I can kind of get that at, to an extent because you can, you can buy Pokemon, I think, actually, wait, no, no, hold that thought. You can't because Nintendo aren't bringing these games to the eShop as of yet. And they're shutting down the services for both the Wii is the Wii U and 3DS? Yeah, it is the, the Wii, U, Wii U and 3DS that they're shutting down the eShop for those two consoles so you can no longer purchase all the classics legally. But yet they're fucking losing their pants over people pirating their games, even though they're not giving them much of an option other than to physically own a console or to go out and pay exorbitant amounts of money for physical copies. That they can rip or burn or play on original consoles which people may or may not have so i think it's kind of a weird move by nintendo on, on that part i mean like me personally i don't see myself getting a switch at least until i see one going on clearance somewhere because i'm not much of a nintendo fanboy or a nintendo fan i've not played a lot of nintendo owned ips bar pokemon in fact the amount of games I've had on my Game Boy and Game Boy Advance, I can count on both my hands. I can literally list them out right now. Um, even Well, they're not Nintendo-owned IPs, but they're third-party. Well, bar Pokemon, but here we go. Pokemon Silver. Uh, Monsters, Inc. Tony Hawk's Pro Skater 2. Uh, what else? Kung Fu Master. Tetris. Driver 3 on the Game Boy Advance. That's about it. I swear to God, I've only ever owned two Game Boy Advance games, and that, and that, and that is that. Driver 3 and Pokemon Fire Red version. Like, I had a Game Boy Advance when it came out, and Pokemon Fire Red version was the game I played exclusively. Because I had a PS2 at the time as well, but I was more focused on buying games for that than I was for my Game Boy. Yes, I got a lot of enjoyment out of the replayability of Pokemon. And yeah, I've not played a Pokemon game since then. I mean, I suppose I've emulated Pokemon Sapphire and Pokemon uh, Ruby. But I didn't really get into those games at, at all. Because I much prefer playing those games on the physical Game Boy. It's just as handy. Uh, but... Uh, yeah, enough rambling from me, guys. Uh, you know what to do. If you did enjoy this gameplay, if you did enjoy this uh, video, be sure to give it a massive thumbs up, comment, favorite, share, and of course, like always, I will see you guys in the next one. So until next time, see ya.